Is it sad to not? Because let's just use my example, okay? Uh, do you really want a mom there who is going to do nothing but criticize the fact that you let all of your bridesmaids pick the dress that they wanted? What they wanted to be comfortable in? Especially the one who was pregnant? Or the fact that you told them to just pick a black dress knowing that they could re-wear this for something else, right? But your mother... Your mother's going to remind you that this is a wedding and not a funeral. Do you want the person there who's going to criticize the card box that you let your mother-in-law make? Because it wasn't up to your mother's standards at all. Do you want someone who's going to force photos of the family because we all have to look like we get along and we like each other, but we really don't. Do you want someone there who is going to criticize the fact that you didn't want to do a daddy-daughter dance with your dad because you don't have that fucking relationship, never did, never will? Do you want someone there who's going to criticize that you had cupcakes, cupcakes instead of a cake? Are you crazy? Who does that? Me. Do you want someone that's going to criticize the color and flower choice that you picked out? Because it's not what I want. It's not what I want. Do you want someone there who's criticizing your wedding invitations because your husband designed them and made them on his own? Because they look like trash. Okay? These are not professional. Most importantly, years later, are you going to ask yourself, did I have the wedding that I wanted? And if you can honestly answer yes, then more power to you. But if there is any part of you that looks back years later and says, I felt it was easier to shut my mouth and let her plan everything so the fighting would just end. Our mothers all had the opportunity to have their day the way that they wanted it or the way that their mother and their aunt wanted it. No part of your day gets to be your mother's do-over, okay? And your family guilting you for not wanting your mom there or mentioning not having your mother there is only saying that because they themselves cannot stand your mother and need her to shut the fuck up too. They're just too scared to admit that.